Every once in a while, we go on these journeys of discoveries together, you and I. And today we're going to journey together with a company that I've experienced only once before, and that company is Netatmo. This company has released a slew of, of home sensors and products. They had a great indoor-outdoor temperature sensor that connected to your iOS device, your Android device, to let you see what the outdoor temperature was with the indoor temperature and everything else that was going on along with that. This is a very cool device. It's an indoor security camera with face recognition. Note the face recognition part. This is where this really is kind of set apart from any other security camera that exists out there. So we're going to unbox this together and we're going to go on this journey together to find out what this is all about because I really have not I have not really dove into this any further than what we're unboxing today. In this box, we're obviously gonna find the camera. Know when your children arrive at home. Be notified if unknown faces actually are sensed in your home. There's privacy customization, there's notifications. There's no monthly fees, so there's no cloud service associated with this. It's a full HD camera with 130 degree field of view. That's actually pretty important because you want a nice wide field of view to be able to catch a whole environment if you wanna set this in, let's say, your, your living room. There's alarm detection. There's an SD card slot. Let's take a look. I mean, let's take a look at this device itself, okay? While we try to go over the features. Obviously, you've got beautiful aluminum design. This is a gold aluminum. You've got the full HD camera on the front. A whole slew of sensors are hidden behind this black film area. On the back of this device, you've got your SD card slot. You've got your micro USB connector, plus you've got your Ethernet connector, okay? Obviously, this does connect wirelessly, but the Ethernet connector is there. If, if you happen to be in range of your wired network, you can obviously get that as well. In the box, we've got our micro USB cable right there. You can check your micro USB cable, beautiful. Our welcome kit. Everything we need to know about the Netatmo range of products, our micro USB cable, and a long cable. This is something that's really important. You don't really realize this until you actually install a security camera. And the thing is with a security camera like this or any kind of device like this, is you wanna, you wanna connect it somewhere ideally, somewhere nicely placed, but that's not necessarily within the range of power. So you need a nice long cable to go along with that and that is what exactly what this is. This has a nice long power supply. And we're going to actually power this up together and we're going to experience this device together so that we can see how exactly it works because I'm really curious how this pairs to the phone, I'm curious how it detects the faces, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Go through the manual together, shall we? Okay, it is meant for indoor use, not outdoor use. That's good to know. Oh, sorry, Mr. Page. Um, it is supposed to be facing the door, not the window. Okay, good to know. You don't want it sitting on a radiator. That's good. You want it sitting on a flat surface. Okay, you want it one meter, so six to 16 feet away from a door. 16 feet away from a door is actually pretty impressive. And obviously, you don't want sun. You don't want sun beaming down on the device. That's pretty much the instructions, minus the. Uh, Obviously, the mandatory FCC warnings. So let's uh, let's go ahead and plug this in here. We're gonna plug that into the micro SD slot right there. Okay, there we go. Uh, it does it come with an SD card? Look at that. It actually comes with an SD card, an A data eight gig micro SD card. Because uh, I've had cameras before that did not come with anything. So let's get our mobile device here and let's uh, uh, welcome.netetmo.com. Let's sign up. So. At least one lowercase, at least one uppercase, at least one number. Okay, it doesn't like the characters. Okay, so I had an Tatmo uh, account already, so obviously we're gonna allow alerts, shall we? We're setting up a welcome. Plug it in. Turn it upside down. Until we see a blue light. You see that blue light? There's a blue light there. This is the first time I've seen any kind of pairing like this. Connecting your, okay, and lit the camera with your device. Now we're gonna connect to the internet. This is the oddest configuration I've ever experienced. Connecting, connecting, connecting. Unable to establish. Okay, let's try one more time. Maybe it doesn't like it because the camera's upside down. Oh, registering your camera. It got it that time. Congratulations, we can now turn your camera right side up. Okay, the camera is right side up. Let's, let's call it office camera because this is where we're setting this up right now. It is office and it is done. Welcome has not seen anybody yet, so we're gonna place this right here. Let's place this right here, which is kind of in view of the, uh, the camera in the office, okay? And let's, um, let's see what happens. You've not seen anybody for a while, consider. You could see the view of what's happening here, so that's, if we can go back. Oh, it found faces, look at that, identify. Okay, so long hold, long press, and you can identify this person. This is Mark, this is me, 
hit done. So obviously it takes a couple minutes for it to kind of recognize people. We're going to create the profile for Mark and it uh, now knows who I am. So it looks like there's an update in progress for the camera. Office camera started, office camera update complete. So yeah, it was updating. So when you when you get this camera, you may want to do that update first of all and let it uh, let it do an update, let it do its thing so that it gets all the latest features for you. And we're going to try once more to leave the room and come back and see what happens. We have left the room and now we are walking back into the room. Hopefully it recognizes that I walked back in the room at exactly well, let's see, 12.54. Take a look at the live view, and uh, hopefully it'll tell us what's going on here. Obviously, lots of things that we are learning together with this camera in order to see what is going on. Real-time update, unknown face has been seen at 12.53. There we go. Uh, why I'm unknown, I'm not entirely sure. We'll find out here, but it says, okay, here's the unknown face. Let's press and hold that. Let's identify them. Let's add them to Mark's profile. So we'll confirm that this is Mark. I guess as it learns faces and it sees different angles, it will recognize that that person was there 40 seconds ago, et cetera, et cetera. So a very cool camera from a very cool company, Natatmo. We're going to check out their presence camera as well, which is their outdoor camera that has a lot of different things like pet detection plus that built-in light. This is the welcome. Check Amazon and all your favorite retailers to figure out where you can get your hands on the Natatmo welcome indoor security camera with face recognition. We're going to bring this one home. We're to try it with everybody in our house, including our pets, and see how it detects the in and out. And hopefully we can connect this to other services so that we can really integrate this into our smart home.